FAA says flights will be grounded across the country for at least another hour and a half while they work out a computer outage. Good morning, I'm Amy Watson. And I'm Ben Hill, this is News Channel 5 this morning, and we have counted dozens of flights delayed in and out of Nashville International Airport this morning as a result of that outage. That's where Brianna Hamlin is live from this morning from BNA. And uh, Brianna, I know you've seen a, a lot of passengers there. Uh, we can see things picking up behind you, scrambling, trying to figure out what's going on. Yes, activity is definitely picking up here at the airport. I've talked to some people, asked if they've heard anything yet. A lot of them said they haven't, but if they hadn't yet, you will soon because the FAA says flights will be grounded until 8 a.m. Central. And if you take a look at the departure list for BNA, that list is expected to grow. Right now, it's more than 40 listed as delayed flights. Now, the FAA says it's working to restore its notice to air mission system. That system allows pilots to communicate any local runway issues electronically. It used to be a hotline, but that phased out with the internet, and now the FAA is reloading that system as we speak. They're trying to validate the integrity of flight and safety information. It did say some uh, functions are getting back online slowly, but we want to make sure everything is fully safe. So again, people are heading over to their flights, but check your in flight information for information on being delayed. Hopefully things get back to normal soon. Now, Rebecca, what are you hearing? So, Brianna, the situation all unfolded really over the past 90 minutes or so. I want to go in depth to give everyone an idea of what happened. We're told this hasn't happened since 9-11. This is a live look right now at the Newark International Airport in New Jersey. Nope, that's the BNA uh, website right now. But our first reports from this outage were from the East Coast, Boston, Jacksonville, Newark, Florida. Uh, workers and gate agents of those airports simply notified passengers they were experiencing a problem before the FAA could get the word out to the public. Some 20 minutes or so later, the FAA addressed the problem publicly. Since then, we know the FAA says some of those functions were starting to come back online, but they then ordered that full ground stop, excluding military and medical, until 8 o'clock central time. It's the notice to air mission alert system that's really causing the delays this morning. News Channel 5's Nick Barris continues our coverage from the 5 Alert Center. So, Nick, explain what this computer system really does. Doing some research on that this morning, Rebecca, I hadn't heard of it. My understanding is pilots call it the NADAM system, and it, basically what it does, it does is provide very important information about takeoff and flight conditions, stuff that they need to know. Everything uh, right now is at a standstill at BNA. You see all the passengers there, the shots, as they're trying to decide what to do next. It's not just in Nashville, but all across the country because uh, the notice to air computer system, as you said, is not working. Now, that system provides detailed, important information to pilots like runway closures, general bird hazard warnings, low altitude construction obstacles, and much more beyond that. These are all things pilots need to know to make sure that the flight is safe. Now, some may wonder why not just run them out hard copies of these reports. Uh, those system warnings, I'm told, can be quite lengthy, and depending on the flight, they can be uh, you know, several hundred pages, as a matter of fact. If it's an international flight, the printing of them takes time, and then getting it to the pilot takes time as well. But that's actually what they're trying to do right now, get them hard copies. But that's going to cause delays. Hopefully, they get that system rebooted, and as we hear now, that hopefully will happen by around 8 o'clock our time.